Good morning. <laughs> um, so I'm on my way to town in a very winter look. I don't know if you can fully see it. Um, and it's actually a nice day today. It was raining the entire week and today it's just like windy. And it was actually colder in the apartment, which is why I dress so winterly. But now in the sun, it's actually very kind of warm. Um, Sounds you can't really know. And I do really like this outfit. So, should be fine. Uh, so, I'm going to bring our wedding disposable cameras. Yes, we still haven't done those, even though it's been like three months almost. Uh, so, I'm gonna take them for developing. And hopefully, they'll be ready like in a week. So, yeah, so I'm like, well, we already did this like um, almost a month ago, but without bringing the cameras now, I brought the cameras. And as for prices, I do want to put them on city and so I've been, most of them said no, so I'm looking for a place to put, develop and put them on city. So, wish me luck. Going to the supermarket because we kind of need little stuff. Um, that's it. Okay, so Sam, it's Fred. Uh, you need to celebrate it. And I'm making chocolate chips cookies. So these are the cookies. And I'm gonna put them here. And then I go and I go there. Look at that, they're getting all big and chunky and yummy. Um, nom, 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 nom. It's been like two minutes, I think, and they're already like puffing, and it already smells like cookie smell. I'm like, ah, cookie smell. Um, yeah, but while this is magic is happening, because um, it is making cookies is magic, I don't care smells wonderful and it's yummy. I'm gonna do this mess which is folding the laundry. Okay so the cookies are all done and it says to let them cool down before you touch them so I'm just gonna take them out and let them cool, get the uh, chill down before I'll put them in a nice box. And we have cookies for Shabbat that was quick nice and easy. Oh, you're filming? Mm hmm. She wanted to catch the first bite, but it was really good. This, she just made this. Mm hmm. My wife. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Mm. Look yeah. at that. Happy. Happy. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I wish that uh, I didn't have so much work today that I could just. Roll around in bed with her. Mm. Okay, so he needs to get back to work and enjoy his cookies. She says I've been losing weight since we moved in here. Yeah. But uh, she's making it interesting on the way. I like her. Well, you walk into town, so this is one walk to town. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I got a lot to work. Mm -hmm. There's a lot to do, so uh, the bad thing is I can't really. All I can do is work 
today and she's free. But she is free to do what she wants. Yeah. So, I don't know, what are you going to do? Uh, um, now that I finished the housework, I'm going to do the album again. Cool. That's nice. Yeah. All right. <laughs> See you later, baby. See you later, boo boo. So it's evening and it's time to make dinner. And today I'm making tomato soup. So now I have the onions and the garlic in the pan. And I made some melon and bananas for shake before. So we drink that and put on the candles for Shabbat. Uh, so yeah, so I'm gonna show you the process of making tomato soup. My first time trying. Mario said to me that in no way they add boiled cooked eggs in the end. And then you have like sort of meatballs in your soup. You have eggs, boiled eggs, so it's nice and chunky. So I'll do that as well. Okay, so I added the carrots and the tomatoes inside the onions and the garlic. I just waited it for it to be a little bit cut the garlic and the onions. And now this all should sit together until it goes soft, which takes about 15 to 20 minutes. I know this from making shakshuka. When you make shakshuka, that's the amount that the tomatoes and the <laughs> the peppers, the tomatoes and peppers, normally takes to get nice and soft. So now I can do the dishes and sort it. And I'll show you the next step. We just put in all of this once it's nice and soft in the food process. So, and it got salt. Salt. Um, this, are, by the way, is our seasoning. Um, and fancy cooking. <laughs> okay, so this is the next step after it's been cooking and getting soft here. You put it in the food processor to get it into a nice paste. So that's what we're gonna do now. So. So we got this nice carroty paste from the food processor. Um, I think I need to add more water to the food processor to make it a little bit more chopped. Um, so I'm gonna add, I think, back in the pot. So yeah, so this is what was cooked in the in the pot with two glasses and water and then mixed and it looks nice and pasty like it should so this is gonna go back to the pot and then I'm gonna show you the next steps. Since the next step is to add water anyway I just added water to the mixture and about like 20 milliliter um, and I'm just gonna put it here and then all the leftover that got stuck in the machine go back to it so, Voila And this is clean. So everybody's happy. So, okay <laughs> So it's gonna go back to being cooked Okay, so the next step in the recipe was to add sugar, pepper, salt, and tomato paste. So I'm gonna add that and I'll show you how the pot gonna look. Put in, I ended up using two tomato paste because I wanted to get the yellow color out. So now it's more like orangey. Um, now it's gonna cook for 10 minutes and then you add rice and more water so I'm just gonna let it cook okay so while the soup cooks and it's starting to smell really good here see it's really starting to look like a tomato soup now now it's already nice so while that's going I'm cooking the eggs to add the Norwegian 
cooked eggs edition. And I'll reorganize the fruit bowl. And the cookies are sitting here before. Did like a nice cookie box next to our coffee and tea. So, you know, you can have a snack with your coffee and tea. So we had a little incident with um, football and then now we organize it. We had mold. Like when my mom gave this to us, they had like a fabric thing. And I guess it got wet and got moldy. So I took it out and I washed it properly. And now that it's dry, I put the foot back. Look at the, all that vitamin C and A. Okay, so we have a nice amount of soup. To Eggs are boiled. So now I'm gonna add some rice to the soup. So let's see what kind of rice we have. I think I'm gonna use the mixed wild rice. We have, these are the rice we have. We have wild black rice, which is super non processed. Um, but it takes really long to cook. And we have mixed organic wild rice, which I think this is the one we're gonna use. And this takes. Hmm, no, this one you have to leave for an hour. Hmm. Okay, so it's GMO free. I don't know if you can see it. Okay, maybe. Oh, yeah, it says GMO free. It's kind of hard to see. Um, this one, however, does not. Oh, it also says GMO free. So uh, I like to use this company because they're really nice. And their website has like vegan recipes and stuff. Uh, well, I think I will use the organic wild rice because I don't know. Because I don't know. I feel like this. So, um, okay, so the rice now needs to sit for an hour in the water. I close the soup. Uh, I think I'm gonna peel the eggs now. What I'm gonna do. Apparently, Mario said the eggs should be chopped like this and go into the soup. So that's what I did. It was the Norwegian instruction. Mm -hmm. He's loving his long hair, by the way. Can you see his? <laughs> this is really long. Look, he can, he's like a uh, uh, Korean. No, like a uh, bob. Bob, you have a bob now. Mm -hmm. I'm a cattle bug. Yeah, a cattle bug. Boys got wild! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> yeah, now, now you look like Paul McCartney on that picture. Yeah? Yeah. yeah, he, yeah. The hippie yeah. age is coming in. Uh. <laughs> yeah, we, we both work in very hippie hairstyle at the moment. I have my hippie hair, he has his hippie hair. I but I think this is a bit more like, how do they stand like? Like 90s boy band. Oh, like oh. take dad and he's 17. <laughs> is, that, is that how they stand? Something like that. Yeah. Don't wanna waste another day. <laughs> <laughs> That's a new 17 song by the way. Uh, no, I'm not going to sing so much. No, it was an A17 song that I was singing. Mm. You were that kind of girl. Yes, I love boy band. Mm. <laughs> I like my one band for sure. My one band boy band. Mm. Yeah. Mm. That's going to be for another channel though. Yeah. My singing. Okay. <gasps> <laughs> Don't eat the camera. <laughs> what is this? Okay, so 
I don't know what to do now. I got stuck with the rice. We only had organic GMO free rice and it needs to sit down for an hour because if they just take it from the plant and don't process it at all. You have to steep it yeah. for an hour and then cook it for like another 20 minutes or yeah. whatever rice usually takes. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. Ah, we don't need rice. Uh, I think it's good though, the moment it's set now. It was probably half an hour. Yeah, I don't know. Well, okay. Fine, another half an hour, that's fine. Yeah. And then another 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. That's not too fine. <laughs> no, so I think it's okay to put it now in the soup and cook it. Oh, oh okay, that would be cool. Yeah. yeah. That would be very cool. Okay, so you hold the camera. Well, I'll do the honors. So this is what you've been doing today? Yes. You've been updating the whole... I've been updating the whole world about my cooking school. <laughs> this is basically the next time my grandma asks if I cook for you, you can just say, yeah, you can go to her vlog. Yes. She yeah, she must be watching. I don't think she knows about YouTube. She knows about Facebook because of the picture issue thing that... My mom, my grandma felt left out because we all were putting pictures on Facebook and nobody was showing our pictures anymore. So she decided that she wants a Facebook too so she can see all our pictures. But she's had Facebook for ages now. Yeah, no, but I'm saying that's the reason why she wanted to get oh. Facebook. So YouTube, I don't think she even, she even knows about YouTube. Well, maybe it's time for an upgrade. This witch. <laughs> That you you give uh, a shekel, and she stirs around, and cooks up water for you, <laughs> all day. No, it's like a shekel for every four hours, is it? Something like that. It's not too expensive. It's subsidized by the government. So she just like kind of she keeps quiet. She doesn't interfere with our personal lives. She's just standing in the cleaning room. Right? What? The witch, yeah. Yes. It's, she's cooking now, don't you hear the flip flip? Yeah, she's cooking now. She's really quick though, I can never catch her in film. Mm. Ha ha ha. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna add basil to the, uh, the eggs. It's not really what it's Yeah, so we have basil and bird and some nice eggs. Okay, you need to hold the camera. Hold the camera, it doesn't go. Internet gold, baby. Internet gold, making fun of your wife. <laughs> I'm just making sounds. It's internet gold. It's how you make viral videos. Yes. This looks really good, man. Yeah. So. That's it. This is just gonna be quick now, and then we're gonna have it. So, next time you see it, it's gonna be in our plates. Yes. This is tomato soup that we're now gonna have. So, Timmy recently started using his little cave. He didn't use it before, but now he really likes his little cave. Uh, let me just sit there. And I just like to tell a little bit about this new snap I got. It's called Viking Dark. I ordered it from online. I get it in the mail. It's really good. It's dark and it gets up in your nose like a soft glove of silk. It smells like leather. It's really good. He's making popcorn because <laughs> we want to watch a movie. And Tim is just chilling there in the little corner. 
and yeah and that's all I wanted to share with you so click like and subscribe and we'll see you guys